This week for your neighborhood, we head on over to Detroit's Midtown neighborhood to a place that by name appears to focus on just children, but the work that they're really doing actually benefits the entire family. It was hard. I thought I was a bad mom. I didn't know what to do. Joanne Al Hachami gets emotional when talking about raising her special needs son. You want them to fit in and you want them to have friends and you want them to do the things that other kids do. Her 15 year old son's difficulty in school would lead her to the Children's Center in Detroit's Midtown neighborhood. There he would find the help he needed. We loved it here. They did, he's, he used to throw himself on the floor. He used to bang himself, hit himself and he just could uh, temper tantrum like he just couldn't control himself and at, he doesn't do any of that stuff anymore. The core services that we provide here are individual therapy, outpatient here on campus, but also we cross the, you know, the doorstep of the of thousands of families each year. Douglas Manigault has worked with families at the Children's Center for the past three years. The 91 year old nonprofit serves 7,500 children and families every year dealing with a number of different issues. A lot of our services focus on trauma informed care. Our mission at the Children's Center is to help children and families shape their own futures. And that starts with them focusing on what does success look like for them. I'm just hoping someday he'll find peace. The Children's Center has been so beneficial to Joanne and her son Amin, she now volunteers her time here, giving back, a place that's helped this mother and many other families. I love him. I'll always be there for him, no matter what. She is a great mom. And here's the thing, I've been to the Children's Center a number of times. That is just a small glimpse of all of the work that they do here for families, for children in our area. And here's the thing, they're always looking for volunteers. So if you'd like to help, maybe if you'd even like to donate money, we have more information on, their, on our website. Just go to clickondetroit.com for that.